This program is brought to you by the friends and partners of AMI. Alleluia Ministries International believes in the Bible and Christ. We are Christ-centered and Jesus is at the heart of everything we believe and do. Our mission is to spread the gospel of Jesus Christ around the world. Through this mission, we seek to empower believers and equip them with the tools to share the gospel with the world and to live a life of faith, hope and love in Christ. Jesus remains the same yesterday, today and forever. Just as it was in Scripture, His power is at work today in the church. We are AMI. We bless you, Jesus. We honor you and we honor your word. Speak through my vocal cord, Lord. May I disappear that you may appear. Touch everyone by the power of your word. May there be healing, deliverance, transformation in Jesus' name. Together we say amen. Thus says the Lord, my glory I will not give to another. The Lord has spoken about his glory. And he wants you and I to know, take note this morning that what is known as his glory that uh, you and i will be witnesses of he will not give it to another he will not share it with another all glory belongs to him and all glory will go back to him thank you jesus somebody under the sound of my voice will understand what god is saying would you please halla glory unto jesus jesus now please be seated if you can we read the book of psalm 96 from verse 8 down to 10. those of you who have a fresh memory will remember that it is not too long ago that god has given us in the prophetic word in the prophetic week this word if you receive this word from god you understand it align with it the lord will manifest through it for your good and that this came to us as a divine instruction. Give to the Lord the glory due his name. Will you find a person in your left or right say, Give to the Lord the glory due to his name? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, my beloved in the Lord, when you dissect the word of God, you must be of those with puppy feet to learn what the spirit is saying in season when i analyze what the lord is saying in this scripture the bible gives us a, a, an instruction to give to the lord i stop there to begin to realize god will never ask you to give something that he has not given to you you have to have something before you are asked to give it away this simply says that in this season God will manifest his splendor in your life. God will show up in a mighty way that you have never seen before. God will do things that I will bring credit. Now he's saying when that credit comes, do not take a share of it. Give it unto God. I am here speaking to you under a prophetic unction of God. I decree and I declare in this new season, Everywhere you go, the glory of God shall manifest. I speak in the name of Jesus. Whatever you touch will blossom in God in the name of Jesus. This season, you will know the meaning of favor. God will favor you. I say God will favor you. God will favor you. The supernatural simply means something that is beyond the natural something that cannot be contained by the natural something that is not regulated by the natural something that is higher by what regulates the natural what the natural cannot produce in your life the supernatural will produce in your life i am seeing you going places i am seeing you breaking through 
I, I am seeing you passing the line of limitation I that walls have stopped you. In I am Jesus seeing name. you matching up with wings like an eagle. I am hearing the sound of your testimony. I receive. I decree and I declare you will testify the goodness In of the, the Lord. In the name of Jesus. If it is you I am speaking to, respond to the word of God. Hallelujah. God will never ask you to give him something that you do not have. Because in the truth, you can tell people what you know, but you can only give what you have. Unless you have it, you cannot give it. Yes. And if God say give it, it's because he's getting ready to give it to you. You will see things around you that I will bring honor, that will bring dignity, that will bring elevation, that will exalt the things Receive around you. It. I decree and I declare, God will open doors for you. In the name of Jesus. Where you are not present, God will send his angels to speak for you. Somebody receive. Those who yesterday made a mistake to mock you will be shocked on to see what God will do for you in this season. I receive. Ladies and gentlemen, yesterday is gone. We are in the time of God. We are Jesus. in the now of God. We are in the appointed time yes. of God. We are in the season where the world as he said it, so we will see it. In the name if it of is Jesus. you, receive it, receive it, receive it, receive it. I receive it. I receive it. Receive it. The time of shame is gone. I receive the it. The time to be stopped is gone. Amen. The time to be denied is gone. Amen. The time to be ignored is gone. Amen. The time to be overlooked In is gone. The name of Jesus. Your time to manifest the glory of God has come. I, I don't know who I'm it. speaking to, but there is a spirit that is downloading what God is saying. Receive it. I receive it. You see, whenever you get the word, you get your miracle because your miracle is in the word. I receive it. When you miss the word, you miss God because yes. God is in his word. Thank you, Jesus. In the beginning was the word, the word was with God and the word was God. So as we are claiming it and sealing it and seizing it, we are not just displaying how emotional we are no we are working out in yes. the spiritual realm what the lord has said to work for us i decree and i declare yes lord the lord your god will take you where you could not get i by receive it i decree and i declare the works of god will manifest around you in the name as of a jesus testimonial of god's love for you Jesus. I decree and I declare where you cried yesterday you will rejoice today in the name of Jesus that. your family has been the last no one minds you every wrong happens to you you watch others being blessed and it seems like uh, you have been put together to just uh, suffer but God is speaking from this altar today Thank you, Jesus. his hand is at work in your life I will see you will begin to see things change I will God see will that. work things again in he will redirect things he will remodel things in the he will name make of it Jesus. work for your good in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus, Jesus. Can you see me? Yes. See, when we do this, it's because we cried and we wept it. Sometimes having a towel or so is too long, too far. We naturally oh, yes. we do this. Meaning that I cried, but I will cry no more. Oh, I, I have tears, it. but I will have tears. It, somebody. I'm here to say, shame will not be your portion. In the name of In Jesus. This season, you will not cry again. I receive it. The Tears of pain, the tears of shame will not come your way in, in the, the mighty name, name of Jesus. I receive it. God will do that. Thank you, Lord. He always does what he said he will do. 
because God is no man that he may lie. Yes. Whatever proceeds out of his mouth comes to pass. Thank you, Jesus. His hand will bring it to pass. I will you see, God that. is God enough to fulfill what he said. I am speaking to somebody who feels life has closed up on you. The Lord caused you to survive to this day because he had a plan for you. Now that you got here, see what the Lord will do. I receive I say, see what the Lord will Somebody do. Somebody receive. There, there, there are some miracles manifestation that takes long. They take time. You have to survive a number of things to get there. But I stand today not as one who has been appointed to motivate you, but rather as a prophet of God imposing over your circumstances and situation the oracles of God, the word of God. God has spoken and so shall it be. It that cannot which be you otherwise. didn't see before, may you walk into it. I receive it. May you walk into that marriage. I receive it. May you walk to that maternity world it. and come out with In your child. May you go to that company and come out with your contract. I may you go it. to the bank and have your smile. In Jesus may you receive it. In the name I of Jesus. I receive it. So shall it be. It cannot be otherwise. Can see people say, I'm blessed. I'm, I'm just blessed. I'm, I'm blessed. blessed. See people, I'm blessed. I'm blessed. I'm blessed. I am blessed. I'm blessed. I'm blessed. I'm blessed. I'm blessed. The name of Jesus. Now, in view of what God sets to do, He wants your commitment that you may not. Do what will displease him in this season. Oh, yes. So the words say, give to the Lord the glory due his name. Yes. This is what God is requiring of you. And that this is what the devil does not want you to do. Satan doesn't want you to credit God. Satan doesn't want you to applaud for God. Satan doesn't want you to elevate God. He will try as much as he can to stop the glory from going back to God. Because he understands that glory is the very reason why God created you. That right. you may give him glory. God wants your life to glorify him. God wants your life to elevate him. Say God that. wants your life to be a reason why they will look at him in his uh, glory and power. Yes. Oh, well, uh, every time uh, God begins to manifest, the devil comes to tell you, oh, well, don't rejoice now. It's mm. too early. Because you see, he's afraid that you give God glory. Mm. But mm. get your commitment known to God. Yes. That every day that he gives you the breath of life, you will give him glory. Oh, yes. Every day that he goes before you and make room for you, you will give him glory. Yes. In every victory that he gives you, you will give him I glory. Will give him glory. Somebody holla, I will give you my glory. I will give you my glory. Jesus. My testimony. I give it to you. Yes, the Lord. credit I give it to you. Yes, Lord. The praise will go to God. Yes, Lord. I will say to the world, look what the Lord has done. He has turned my mourning into dancing. I used to be low, but the Lord has lifted me up. Glory to Jesus. I am up. I am high. I am blessed. I am hooked. I am elevated. I am exalted now Jesus. by the grace of God. And second, he said, bring an offering and come into his court, bring an offering. Uh, I say this, uh, he will not ask you to give what he has not given you first. Yes. A man can only have what is given to him, says the word. That's right. And he said, as you will see my glory and you will begin to count things that I manifest in your life, give me. An offering, an offering that 
reflect the glory that I have manifested. Oh, Jesus. An offering that becomes an expression of your gratitude toward the works of my hands. Come to the courts of God. Come to the house of God. Come to the altar of God mm. and present your offering. Your offering is for your worship. Yes. You worship God with your offering. When you come to your altar, the Lord says, do not go empty-handed. Hear me. Givers who will align to be givers before even having a seed to give. Just because of the attitude, the Lord will see them. And the Lord will come their way. For the word that. of God says, God gives a seed to a sower. Yes. A sower without a seed should not be afraid because he is a sower and oh, being a sower attracts the seed. There is provision coming your way. I receive it. I will give this year. I will give to my altar. Oh, yes. I will give everything. I will, I will give it. until I believe. I'm telling you my commitment. Oh, yes. I am telling you what flows within me. I understand what God is doing in this season. I will push myself and I know no one can outgive God as I give unto him for his glory. More will I see. I will save it. You know, it is dangerous whenever one who walks with God expects of God to do incredible things begin to feel weakened by God well if I give God I'll have nothing you had nothing when you came right everything you have God has given you yes so every time God asks you to give and you begin to understand giving should be part of you you, you must wake up to look for what to give in this season that is you must go out there and say god i need a seed I, I i need to find my offering of the day if you set it as your attitude as a giver you say lord in this season i will give far more than i ever given let me tell you your testimony in this season will shake this world i believe and i receive it in the name of jesus in jesus name oh worship the lord in the beauty of holiness tremble before him all the earth Jesus. now hear this verse 10 and we go to isaiah verse 10 say among the nations that this year do not keep quiet i receive it this year the lord is anointing your lips i receive it in the name of this, Jesus. Yeah, they will hear your voice. I receive it. For God is giving you something to say. Say among the nations. I will say The it. Lord reigns. Somebody holler, Adonai. The Lord reigns. Say yes. amongst the nations. Adonai. Adonai. The world will come to understand that the last word belongs to the Lord our God. Oh yes. So he reigns no one else. No one else is supreme enough to speak and it comes to pass. The Lord reigns. Mm. Cancer does not rule the day. Jesus. Leukemia does not rule the day. No. Sugar diabetes does not rule Ooh, the day. No. The current economic difficulties of your region does not rule the day. Okay, no. The Lord reigns. The world also is firmly established. It shall not be moved. Why? Because you see, anytime you cleave on God, you lean on God, your world your home your life your business I the industry you operate on I will also it. be established and not more in the name receive of jesus. that in the name of jesus i receive it receive it in the name of jesus i receive it now my precious in the lord very quickly please be seated we speak about the glory but what is the glory the glory is the quality of splendor distinctive only in Yahweh hmm. the quality of splendor that is found 
exceptionally only in Yahweh, in Jehovah, in the G-O-D of your mm. life, in Elohim, the eternal self-existing God, the uncreated creator. When we speak of the glory, we speak of ultimate level of honor. Mm. Give God glory is to honor God in the highest. Thank you, Jesus. Honor Him this year. Give Him glory for everything He will do. I will You save come it. out of the past, say, I give you glory. Yes, Lord. I will not credit the past driver. I may be grateful that He did His job, but the glory belongs to you. Yes, Lord. The honor belongs to God. Honor Him. Many times when you read the scriptures and the Bible speaks of the word glory, you will see in different contexts that it points sometimes to his greatness. So we glorify him because glory here speaks of his greatness. May I please look for another mm. word to just enlarge somebody's spirit. His bigness. Oh yes. Hallelujah. His glory has to do with his bigness. Jesus. His bigger than big he's greater than greater he's higher than any height he's god he's god somebody lift your hand say i give you glory i give you glory the kaboth of god is the glory of god and the glory of god in the kaboth of god is the weight of god as god puts his weight on you is god putting his support on you when we speak of his glory we speak of his weight yes. he's uh, putting his weight on you you see if you bid on something and you have a good great support good support putting weight on you meaning that they're backing you up you know that through the support i will go through i will make hear me the glory of god is a kaboth of God. Yes. Is the weight of God. You are not it. alone, child of God. I will save it. Never feel alone. He's with you. Jesus. In all his glory, he's with you. Mm. Everywhere you go, he's with you. He's backing you up. He's backing you up. Thank you, Jesus. In everything you do, he's backing you up. Hallelujah. It doesn't matter how many of them stand against you, but the Lord is on your side. He's backing you up. This is the reason why you will see them come you'll see them go but you will remain standing because the lord is backing you up he's saying I to you my son that. i have your back my daughter i have Thank your you, back fear not for i the lord will make it happen in jesus name i will save it when we speak about the glory of god we're talking about what gives him credit the credit Meaning that he has done something and he needs to receive the result that flows from it. Credit God every day. Credit Hallelujah. God. Whoever comes to you and says to you, God is not to receive credit for this. Prayer prayed has nothing to do with this. Your altar did not produce this for you. Your fasting is not the reason why you have it. Mm -mm. Just know the devil is working. Yes. Trying to pollute what God has given you. In everything, choose to elevate God. Choose to yes. credit God. He is the one who gave you the breath of life. Free of charge. Hallelujah. If you even hear, it's because he's here for you. Better than you are no more. Better than you are no way. I will say But you are here. Thank you, Jesus. Lord, I want to thank you. I thank you. I will not boast and say, well, I work hard. You see, whatever I do now came from my, my hard working. No, no, no. The hand of God. The hand of God. The hand of God. The hand of God. Thank you, Jesus. We speak about the glory of God as its manifested presence. When the glory of God is seen, the presence of God is manifested. When Jehovah Jireh manifests, that is the glory. When Jehovah Nisi manifests, that is the glory. When Jehovah Rapha manifests, that is the glory. Yes, Lord. When Jehovah Shammah manifests, that, that is, is the glory. The glory. 
when Jehovah Shalom manifest mm. that is the glory Thank when you, Jehovah Roy manifest that is the glory, the glory. when Jehovah Chikenu manifest that, that is, is the, the glory. glory somebody get ready Jehovah's praises is about to manifest ah, in your life say that somebody receive now, why do we give him the glory? Can I have all my ordained pastors come, come on the on the altar, stand on the on the altar, stand here. Lababo shorobo soto. Surely something is about to happen. Receive it. I said, surely something is about to happen. I receive it. Give him glory. Give him glory. Somebody give him glory. He deserves your glory. Give him glory. To him alone, all the glory. Hallelujah, ministries. Give him glory. Give him the glory. Yes, Lord, receive the glory. Receive the glory. Glory to Jesus. 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 Now hear this. Why do we give him glory? Two things. He created us for his glory. Yes, Lord. I stretch my hand along with my sons over you in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. That the purpose for which you were created, brought into existence, may manifest in this year in the name of Jesus. I receive it. You were not born for misery. For misery does not glorify him. Yes. You were not born for defeat. I receive. For defeat does not glorify him. Yes. He puts you together using material that responds only to glory. May you walk in the glory for which you have been designed. I receive. The it. glory for which he has made you. That you be a vessel that will come to him and present the same and say, I give you all the glory. Yes, Lord. To you alone. Everyone lift your right hand. Say, defeat is not my portion. Defeat is not my portion. Say, mediocrity is not my portion. Mediocrity is not my portion. Say, I was created to give God glory. I was created to give God glory. Say, my life will glorify my God. My life will glorify my God. Say, my home will glorify my God. My home will glorify my God. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. The second reason why we ought to give him glory is because he alone is worthy to be glorified. Amen. Did you understand that no one else deserves the glory? Nobody else. Oh, well, we thank people for their effort. We thank them for the endeavor in doing things correctly. I thank God for my doctor. I thank God for my lawyer. I thank God for the one who drove me. I thank God for the cook. I thank God for all that is happening. But the glory oh, yes. is reserved to go to the only one 
Yes, Lord. Who sees everything? Who yes, is able Jesus. to do everything? The one who controls life. Thank you, Jesus. He deserves the glory. Yes, oh God, Lord. I thank you for my leaders. I thank, thank you for you, my Lord. pastor. I thank you for my prophet. I thank you for my apostle. Mm -hmm. But I give you, you the, the glory. glory. I give you the glory. Receive my uh, glory. I thank you for the counselor. I thank you for the mayor. I thank you for the chair. I thank you, oh Lord, for the deputies. I thank you for those in parliament. I thank you for Mr. President. But Mr. President receives no glory. The glory belongs to the Lord. King of Kings, to yes. the Lord of Lords, to yes. the Alpha and the Save Omega, the to the beginning and to the end, to the Savior of this world. Yes. Receive the glory, Lord. He alone deserves the glory. Yes, Lord. Be thou glorified, O oh God. Yes, Lord. Lift your hand, somebody, and begin to glorify him. Begin to say, Yes, Lord. I thank you. Jesus. I give thank you all you, the Jesus. glory and all the praise. I give thank you all the Jesus. I worship you, Jehovah. Yes, Lord. If you were blessed by this video, please share and spread the message on social media using the share links in this video. Be sure to like and share our videos with your friends and family. Tune in to catch his next sermon on the public channel on AMI-TV or on our live stream on AMITV.com. Keep up with all his latest updates by following him on social media platforms at Elflukawa.